Hi everyone, welcome to Big Oggy Golf. And this is not Wednesday. This is Tuesday, as you will probably know. Uh, and I am at West Cornwall Golf Club. Now, normally I go to play West Cornwall, which is my home club. Normally I play on a Wednesday, and that's the Wednesday comp. Um, but today I'm here and it's Tuesday. And the reason is uh, Wednesday and Thursday, I think, are fully blocked up. Um, West Cornwall Golf Club is one of the courses that's hosting something called uh, Coast to Country. Uh, Coast to Country is a 36-hole comp over two days and uh, half the competitors play on one day at West Cornwall and then the other day at Tahiti which is a parkland course just down the road and then on the on the other day they swap over so uh, they've pretty much blocked up the whole of those days for that competition no competition for me this week uh, so I'm here to meet up with one, one of my friends uh, Steve Steve Jones and uh, we're going to just hit some balls about really. Uh, I put the tea time in about an hour. I know, I'm here early. Uh, and uh, I'm going to try out my new swing. So no pressure today. Steve's great. Steve's a very relaxed person when I play with him. And he's always very helpful and understanding. And uh, we're going to try out this new revamped swing that Matt's been giving me over the last uh, few days. And um, see how it goes. Um, I'll try and get a few little bits and pieces on camera i've got my phone with me today really that's about it uh so i might just take a few a uh, little bit of picturesque shots so maybe a few um shots of us hitting some balls and that'll be a very gentle um introduction to steve into our channel and uh hopefully i'll be getting steve on there properly and uh, we'll be doing some proper filming at some point steve has a very unusual swing i have to say sorry steve uh but uh it works you know and he's a fantastic little links player and he just knows this course like the back of his hand really and been playing a long time. Uh, so, what else to say? Um, hmm. Bacon sandwiches. Yeah, go on. Uh, it seems to me that certainly when you get all these comps and everything, like what will be happening in the next couple of days, everything is to do with bacon sandwiches. You know, you, you, you get there early, oh, coffee and a bacon sandwich, coffee and a bacon bap, coffee and a bacon roll, coffee and a bacon stotty, wherever you are in the country. What is it about golfers and bacon? Not that I'm complaining, because it's one of my favourite foods. Uh, so, are you a crispy bacon person? Do you like it done to death? Or are you one of those kind of limp, pale, just let it wave it a little bit of a heat source and then stick it in the bun kind of person? Uh, are you a brown sauce and red sauce person? Oh, I know, the, the questions I'm asking today. Um, I'm just filling, I'm just filling, honestly. Right, we're going to go and, uh, I'm going to go and get a bacon roll. And uh, then I'm going to quit a bit of practice and then I'll be on the course. Little bacon sandwich I'll be at the discussion already uh, we are on the putting green at West Cornwall Golf Club uh, just warming up really waiting for uh, it's been quite a busy morning uh, quite a few people playing today I think they're all kind of coming early and they're probably practicing ready for the competition that starts tomorrow uh, so I'm gonna introduce you to a gentleman he is a gentleman honestly good afternoon this is Steve Steve James or little Steve, if I caught him on this channel from time to time. Thank you. Uh, look, come on. Just not much yeah. difference. Not not much of a height difference. Uh, gentleman from Manchester originally, yeah? Mm -hmm. Yes. Manchester fan. He knows all about success. Man City fan, yeah? Handicap? 22. 22. It's fluctuated a little bit recently. You've been a few yes. iffy times, haven't you? Yeah, it's not been good. But uh, You're going to put me right, I'm told well, you. Well, as Steve would often say when I'm playing well, He's taught me everything, uh -huh. yeah, and uh, we won't um, discuss about Matt Tutnut and trying no, to no, keep no, him no, no, yeah, yeah. And, and I earn quite a bit of money, this gentleman here. 
so uh, we're gonna just play a few holes and um, we'll put a little bit on camera, just a few pictures of swings, etc. And um, I'll start making him famous. And then we'll, at some point we'll do a proper few holes together and we'll film a whole lot. Thank you, John. All right. He's always said he wanted to become famous. Look, see, look how much he got to look up to me, mate. Oh, well, yeah. great. Okay. I also so. look up to you, John. That's true. I've heard. <laughs> right, we're gonna get cracking. See you in a little while. Game's not going too badly. Uh, first couple of drives were pretty iffy. Iron's pretty good actually. Uh, thank you, Matt. Things are improving. Certainly better striking anyway. Distances are all wrong, but that's because I'm pitting the ball better. Uh, my friend Steve is opposite here. We're playing uh, the 14th and there's a split in this fairway. So I'm on this side, he's on the other side. Um, what can I say? Uh, yeah, I think it's good. things are going okay. I need to get a driver lesson, which I'll be getting with Matt on Friday. Hopefully I'll some more things out for that and I might be ready for the golf day on Monday. You never know. Right, Steve, uh, we're on the 15th. It's a bit blowy. I have to say, 15th is a par three and everyone knows I hate par threes at the moment, but it'll be fun. Uh, so the question I'm asking everyone today is bacon sandwiches and golfers. Okay. Right. Uh, well, you come from Manchester, so was it a barn cake up there or something? Yeah, it could be on a barn cake, yeah. <laughs> With brown sauce. With br well, that's the other question. Brown or red sauce? Gotta be brown sauce. And uh, crispy or limp and pink? In between. Oh, <laughs> in between. Because uh, I know you play lots of different like societies and cons, and you play all over the place. So, uh, is it still one of those traditional mainstays that all these kind of comps have that you get? Bacon butter before home, yeah. Coffee to bacon butter before you go out. Oh, see, I, I love I love the healthy nature of golf, don't you? Absolutely. Right, let's hit this bar free. See what I'm. It's camera, it's, oh, he's, he's not used to this yet. That's on the green. Well Part done, John. On the green. Well done. Never happens. Thank you very much, Matt. That lesson is working really well. <laughs> good, good, good. Right or right up it? Um, I'm a little bit to the right. Went, over the, went over the right hand. I can here. see it. Pin yeah. high. Matthew, it's pin high. I can't complain at that, Steve. That, I know you don't watch YouTube. You really got to start watching YouTube, but that was what my lesson was all about this week. Trying to hit more of a straight arm in the follow through and forgetting about the pressure of par threes. What a time to come bloody good when Absolutely. it's all square. Yeah, when it's all square and we've got some money on it. It's only a pang, just not carried, get carried away. That's only a pound for you. Uh, it's got it's chances, it's going to bounce along. Correct. I think it's just short of the bunker, which is probably a good place to be after that. Thank you, John. That's all right. I don't know what I'm teaching you for. <laughs> okay, just short of the bunker, but that's a good place to be here. Got the height. Rolling up on the slope. Oh, you can't go wrong with that, Steve. Too far away. No. Okay. 
Very good. Well done. Teach you up within six foot of the flag. Let's have a count past it. Putting for a birdie, you can do it. Helicopters go over, I get a par, Steve's giving up the hole. <laughs> Thanks, Steve. Thanks for that. Bit of fun. Well done, mate. Whew, okay, so I'm plum tuckered out already, I have to say. I'm really not fit enough for this game. Uh, Steve and I are level, and we're on the 18th. Steve just won the last of par three. He's a really long par three. Uh, I was doing well until then. But uh, this is the 18th at West Cornwall. It's very tempting. It's kind of straight down, and it makes you want to hit too hard. So we go. That's out left. Normally Steve's shot swing in right, but I don't know if he's going to. But at least you're safe because our horrible road on the right hand side, which I normally bounce down. We shall see. It's a good angle to come in from. Okay. John's about to punish me for that wayward left shot. So most of the time I play this, I swing them out desperately left to right, and then they bounce down the road. So, oh please, please. Yeah, yeah that's what you like. <laughs> it's one of those do you play safe now, isn't it? Just keep going. Well, it's not right, but that's safe enough. No, it's safe, safe enough. enough. It's in play. Right. All to play for still, Steve. Oh, nerves are getting to me. Okay, so Steve's hit his shuck and shot. Um, I've come over here to hit mine. I'm on the right hand rough, uh, and it's still pretty much straight down. I'm gonna try and film this, sticking this bag and this camera together. pretty good we'll find out as you just said the all to play for we are pretty much neck and neck two shots in that's got chances as well by the flag little ball oh oh I don't know what to say Steve that's just all I know is I've got that on camera. For, that's brilliant. Well done, mate. No pressure then, Steve. No. Come here then. <laughs> what am I going to do with that? That might be too much of 7 iron, John. I'll just do a picture right here. Okay. John's trying to recover from my amazing shot near the flag. <laughs> Well, he's made the green, but it's a long way, long way from the hole. I think it might not be the right club. I think you all go a bit gentle. Unless you're teaching again, you're doing it deliberately now. Well played, Steve. Okay, so I'm on the green, but kind of only just, and there's a long way to go with a slope in front of me, and Steve is super close. What have you just suggested? You're thinking of uh, laying down between the ball and the tee to prove it's five feet away, is that right? Five away, yeah, from the flag. Yeah, you will too, knowing you. Right, Steve, film this this attempt and I'll film you winning the off. Not too close please John. Let's go 
got to get up, it's not far away. Just give it a very good go. Okay, now before we get any further, um, do I get a shot on this hole because you're a 22 That's and I'm a 31? Made me think then, yeah. yeah, I know, so if you put this in, you win. You're 31. Nine, it's stroking next 10, is it, this hole? I think so. So do I get a shot or not? I think you do get a shot. Not that I'm counting, do I really care? No. He's just trying to make me nervous now. <laughs> Steve, I want you to put this in, mate, because you deserve it. After that second, oh, that shot there was just amazing. Put it in the hole. Oh, oh well game. done, well played. Proper par four on a par four. Well done. So I think I've got this shot to draw. To half hit there. Is it running? Uh, it should be. Okay. No pressure. Oh, doesn't matter. You deserve it for that. Honestly. Oh, he's got it. We've been all the way round. On the 18th, it's finished up all square. I know, we could just play one off. That's it, yeah. Okay, so that's a little quick introduction to Steve Jones, who is a member of West Cornwall, and we're going to go and play uh, a few holes here at some point properly for a little course vlog against each other, and maybe some other places, maybe go to Mullion or somewhere else. Sounds good yeah, to, to me. Hiddy. I haven't done to Hiddy yet. They haven't let me play yet. yet. All right. right. Uh, so, thanks very much for watching. Um, let us know in the comments below about what sort of bacon sandwich you have and whether you have red sauce and brown sauce. Important stuff today, just important stuff. Uh, I've got a lesson with Matt on Friday, driver lesson. I think I might need one of them a little bit. But the irons are going really well. So if you're going to the YouTube golf day, hope to see you there. If you're not, please try and at least put a bit of donation in the pot in the uh, comment below section. Lovely. Thanks very much, everybody. See you soon. Well done, John. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.